Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be making an alloy of gallium and aluminum. Gallium is a metal right here, it's a liquid slightly above room temperature. Aluminum I think we all know of, I have granular aluminum right here. Now aluminum is actually a very reactive metal, however it forms a protective layer of aluminum oxide and therefore prevents further reaction. So what we're going to be doing today is exploiting aluminum's reactivity by alloying it with gallium and then introducing that alloy to water. What's going to happen is because the aluminum is in an alloy that's liquid at room temperature, the gallium aluminum alloy, it's not going to be able to form a protective layer. And because of this, it's going to react quite vigorously, as we'll see later. So I'm going to add small amount of aluminum to the gallium, mix it in and heat it up. So I'll come back after the alloy has been made. Alright, now the alloy is done, so you can see some excess aluminum in the chamber where I made it. Pour that into a beaker. Now, you can observe the reaction when I add water. happening is aluminum is reacting to produce aluminum oxide or hydroxide and hydrogen gas which you see bubbling out. The gallium is not affected. Right there. I've heard of this uh, alloy being used in possible alternate fuel sources but I don't think anything practical has come of it yet. So using gallium, we can exploit aluminum's high reactivity. 